And so I thought, wow, this is the blue. I can see the future here. And here we are in 2015. Thank you so much for all the work you did. And also, I didn't realize like that Brian, who I met earlier, he was one of the students and that was his daughter. So the seeds that were planted back in the 90s are coming up now. It's amazing. But you're also old. <laughs> well, thanks again.
that this last night. <laughs> uh, but we were walking around the Alpamata and it was just me and Ashley because no one else came. So it was all the people. <laughs> um, so we were trying to like figure out what to get. So we're like, all right, we got something practical. So inside here is um, we were like, oh, get them Phoenix because they're gonna cry. Um, and then I was like, oh, if they don't cry, then we'll get them some coffee mochi because they're gonna be hungry. <laughs> so, so we have some. We have. If you guys can come up, um, we have a small gift for you. And um, we also had a lot of. We bought a lot of Phoenix. So the one from Mr. Yo has four Phoenixes today because I know you cry a lot. <laughs>
Chris Kelsey und Jungen. I cannot begin to tell or express my deepest appreciation and gratitude for the love and commitment that you have given to the love these past two years. You and Chelsea are unashamed in using your talents to glorify the Lord. It is, a, it is obviously a medium if you excel it and you beautifully express your love for our King. Thank you, Joseph, for your willingness to be vulnerable during our Bible studies. For always being someone that others can go to, confide in, and for having a sympathetic and compassionate ear. Thank you, Joseph, for being an amazing blessing to me and to the love for these past two years. Ms. Chelsea Rubin. Help those who have the same question that you have. 
you create these spirit shows in your film, and it becomes a powerful tool as to how you communicate. I look forward to see how God will use those talents as he holds and molds them into a powerful instrument for his kingdom and his Thank you for your commitment and leadership. 
I really miss. To use your physical talents and lead us in the worship and chapel. And as it's such a soul beautiful gift tonight, to lead us into the purpose of God. I'm also wait, I thank you for your willingness to share your testimony with the Lord. Many people have commented to me about how they have seen evidence of God's providential hand in your life. You are today so well that God can orchestrate his plans in our lives regardless of the situation and how he can turn beauty out of ashes. As you quoted in Jeremiah 29 11, which the later part of verse says to give you hope and a future, your life is a testament of his faithfulness and his goodness. So thank you for all being obedient, for being patient, and to wait upon him to bring all his promises. Thank you very much.